Welcome, everyone. Uh, let me just move the camera a bit more. There we go. All right. Getting focus. There we go. Yeah, I'm using something to hold my S, my Samsung S23 Plus because I'm using it to record this video. I do have to say something. The artwork for the MFT F03 Fighter Club, which this is some Halo which is MF30, MF42. This is one of three, one of the three Rainmakers. So I don't have as a storm or bit stream. I need to find those two. Um, also by the looks of things, uh, he is supposed to come with different weaponry. Instead I got the, um, clear ones which is supposed to be silver these are clear oh and also if you can't tell he's also sparkly also he's made up of two things plastic metal all plastic just this chest piece here is metal and is actually very, it's the same yellow by, by any standard. Also, I like to notice, I like to point out before I even get into anything. Thigh swivel here, peg is too tight. The pin for this, yes, that pin, it's too big. It's a, just a little too big and it's a little too snug, which is why what you heard was this I'm going to be using it on this when I transform him also he transforms in a nice little different way but when I got him in box he came from China of all places yes I know sacrilege for any transform fan this is how he came in box which was styrofoam All padded and when I did when he was in when he was listed he was actually in jet mode so I really wish he came with his with the gray stuff the gray weaponry I should say not gray stuff gray weaponry so solar halo aka sunstorm here is based on a, a McDonald Douglas f-15 Eagle Actually, every single Rainmaker and such is based on an F-15 Eagle or an F-16. I can see you in the comments going, there is no F-16. Well, I hate to tell you, look it up. And I do mean, look it up. Acid Storm has, um, from the photo I'm looking at, when he transforms, he does actually... These do actually flip so these are part of his legs by the looks of things but at the same time they don't look like they're part of his legs also when i got him also when i got solar hair these were um on differently because they are supposed to um match this part so they were on the wrong sides so transform him first let's start with the head Turn it sideways. You ain't gonna believe where his head goes. Now with the original generation one transformers and such, the this area here was where the nose code would actually go through. The arms would swivel out to here. And yes, he does actually have the wheel there. So let's remove one. Two, and I think these are for something for someone else. Question mark? Question mark? Um, if anyone can tell me in the comments, please do. So, nose code up. We will unpeg the pilot. Those pilots. Now, you want this arm? Turn. 
into that because this is the wheel and yet they the arm doesn't go all the way down which is a shame so this arm turn straighten up like so then we take the head you can see where this is going fold yeah his head is going to be tucked in there Now before we even do anything, put the pylons back down. They should just snap into place like so. Now this is the part I hate. So like I said, I have to get the spludger. Just to get that leg transformation started. Because you're gonna want the foot. Yes, there is some articulation to go up. Whereas this one, I can actually do quite well. Then take the wings, make sure that they're folded correctly again. And there we have the M. Douglas flip out the, uh, yeah, those are the wheels. So you you can literally tell, oh look, there's a robot. So yeah, he's literally flying with his head between his legs. And that's the McDonnell Douglas F-15 Eagle. And yeah, you can plug these back in. I've been trying, since I've had him... Um, so today's Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday. I've had him for over, just over 24 hours. Yes, he's a fun little toy. Do I want the other two that go with him? Yes, so I can have, say I have a full set of the Rainmakers. Because I literally have to find and I do mean I literally have to find MF F zero one and MF MFT F01, which is which includes Starscream and such, and then MFT F02, which includes Ramjet and such. And by the looks of things, I can actually get Perceptor um, and such, including my Shark Cons, which I do want. I do want my Shark Cons. Uh, Inferno and Hook, I can get. Um, there is a clear limited edition Ultra Magnus, which is kind of like the one I have. I need to get a better one. I'm just trying to see if the seller has the one I want. And they don't have MF T zero F zero one. Which is a shame.
because I really need to get him, get um the other two. Um, there is, oh, okay. Um, F02C, okay, that would actually help me as well. That would actually bulk out my um, Decepticons in MFT. Which I can actually I can pre-order. Okay, I can pre-order. So we have what looks to be the cone heads for. MFT F zero two C. Though I am looking at one which includes Ramjet, Thrust, and Dodge. Now I do actually have a bit of history with um the Generation 1 Transformers, because I grew up with them. I have Ramjet. I also have Menasaur with Rollout. Um, I have drag strip. I have a tur I think it's G2 transformer with the light piping. So I am looking well and truly over if I were to get um, the ones I need IF off eBay and such, I am looking over $150. And I do mean I'm looking over $150. 100, between 110 to over $200. Crazy, isn't it? That the sets I need are expensive just to build up what I need and I'm looking at one that I can use I think it's plastic cement to fix Which for me would be a good way because it's Skywarp and I can easily transform him. Um, you have seen me show off not Galvatron and every and the rest, including Shockwave. Um, I am looking at trying to get a new Ultra Magnus and such. Because I, I need to... I, I want to just complete my MFT series of Transformers. Um, I do want to get a different Omega Supreme. Because I want to... Um, I want my collection to be different. So like MFT with um, the bigger size Transformers that make up Predator King and such. So Devastate can hold one of these guys. Same with Predator King, or Mega Supreme, or Trypticon, for that matter.
I really wish I had my original Ramjet out from storage or one of the other MFT transformers to actually give you an idea of the size, the size comparison and such. But I am looking through and I'm finding ones that are a little expensive. Not even, I'm finding ones that are a little expensive for me to actually get. But I will hunt down what I need, considering what I need is literally the other two jets for to this guy. Uh, along with Starscream and such. So basically I'm missing, if I'm, I'm missing 11, I'm missing 11 jets. But overall, I'm I'm happy with Solar Hilo here. Yes, you can tell there's a robot underneath. And like I said, you can literally see glitter. So yeah, he's a he's a little sparkly on the sparkly side. But overall, he's a good figure. So if you don't want to like spend X amount of money and such. You can find good deals on eBay and such. But anyway, that's enough for me. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell for more notifications. I will be looking at, let's see, Friday's free game day. And I do mean it is free game day Friday. And I just found it original generation one ratchet but it's yellowed like completely yellowed which means i would have to oh that's something i don't want to do that is something i do not want to do oh. if i do get the ratchet i'm looking at he is yellowed, and I am going to have to try and get that yellow off the white just to bring him back to full white. But I will do a, a history on Sunstorm here. And I do mean, I will try and do a history on him. But anyway, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell for more notifications. Share the video with other Transformer fans and happy hunting.